Yo, what's cracking, everyone? Eric Ship Triple One here, and we are back on Forza Horizon 4 with another episode of Hidden Secrets, Easter Eggs, Glitches, and Funny Moments that you, the subscribers, have found in the game. This is a series where you send me interesting things you have found in the game and the ones which are the most unique and haven't yet been showcased on my channel will possibly get a chance of being featured in a future episode. To send me the things you have found, make sure to either write them down in the comment section down below or direct messaging them to me through Instagram, Twitter or Xbox, either by describing them or recording it in video form. Please just make sure that it is in the best quality possible so it can be used in an episode. All of the links will be down in the description below and hopefully I'll see some of you guys in the next video. So let's take a look at seven secrets, Easter eggs, glitches and funny moments that you have found in Forza Horizon 4. Starting off with number one, a different colored dash. So one thing we'd love to see in a future Horizon game is the ability to actually customize the interior, whether it's adding gauges to changing steering wheels to even customizing the color of the interior. These features are seen in many other racing titles, including Car X Drift and most notably The Crew 2. Well, here's a clip that kind of suggests that if the game bugs out, yes, interior color customization is a possibility. As we can see here, this player is driving around in the Mini Cooper and as he heads into cockpit view, the interior dash and steering wheel has surprisingly bugged out to the color red. Of course, everything else in the car, including the clusters, door trims and roof lining remains the same, which leads me to believe that this is just some graphical bug that somehow didn't load the dash texture properly while exiting photo mode. Not something that can be deliberately replicated, but certainly cool to see. Would you want to see interior modifications in a future Horizon game? And a huge shout out to Starring Movie 172 from Xbox for sharing this with all of us. Thank you. Number 2. Body Parts Do Come Off now, a couple of episodes back, we did discuss that in the first Horizon title, how the damage models of all the cars were a lot more critical. What I mean by this is when you compare a car getting smashed in Horizon 1 compared to all the other Horizon titles released on the Xbox One, the newer games were a lot more subdued. We didn't get windshields going completely bust, body parts like bumpers and side skirts falling off, to headlights and taillights being completely shattered. Of course, we did find one car, the Ford Cortina, where if you reverse into a tree with damage turned on, the taillights would actually blow out, leading to no more lights while braking. But here is another car that does somewhat feature a damaged model that includes falling body parts, and that is the Honda Civic Type R EK9. As we can see, if we damage the car enough, a side skirt actually falls off. I mean, how many other cars do that in Horizon 4? Even the inner mouldings can be seen, which is pretty cool. But anyways, a huge shout out to Arv the Racer one from YouTube for sharing this with us in the comments section of my video. Thank you. Number three, a funny moment. As most of you know by now, in each episode, we will feature a couple of funny moments in order for more of you, the subscribers watching, to get involved. Just make sure to send in your clips saying funny moment, and I'll be sure to check it out. All right, so as we can see here, this guy is... <laughs> Hang on, I didn't even get a chance to explain. Can I please see that again? All right, so... Looking at this AI car, he just rebounds and ricochets off from the checkpoint because he hit that cobblestone wall. And just be glad that you weren't the one that was rebounding off that wall. But here's the funny thing. I was going through many of my other messages and other players were also experienced this particular bug as well, which makes me assume that this particular bug was somehow embedded into a recent update. Anyways, a huge shout out to <laughs> from Xbox and C underscore Huggins dot S from Instagram for sharing this funny clip with us. Thank you. Number four, the invisible bush. Perhaps one of the most minute of glitches that not even I would have noticed even if I had accidentally stumbled across it myself. Perhaps you might be in the same boat too, but let's see. I wonder how many of you know about this. So what you want to do is head over just here where the Fortune Island icon is 
and along this stretch there is a row of houses overlooking the ocean. Now if you drive slowly onto the driveways of these houses, everything will be normal. However, there is one house that is of course mildly bugged. In this particular house here, if you slowly drive up on the driveway and pass these small trees, you will notice something a little odd. Did you see it? I'll show it again. Yes, that's correct. Little shrubs and leaves appear to break away whenever you drive past this particular point of the driveway as if there's a barrier of trees that's invisible. A pretty cool secret bug and a massive shout out to Mark underscore Archer17 from Instagram for sharing this with all of us. Thank you. Number five, different years. This is something quite intriguing. Now, of course, we all know that in the past two Horizon games, there has been these special cars known as Horizon or Forza Edition cars. These are basically normal cars that have been spiced up by Playground Games and then added to the car list as additional vehicles for us to collect. These cars are supposedly much harder to obtain, but to be honest, they're not, especially in Horizon 4. However, what must be noted is that if we revert all the Forza Edition cars back to stock, apart from their unique boost bonuses, all of their stats would be identical to their base counterpart. However, there is one Forza Edition car that's slightly different to its base variant, and that is the Alfa Romeo Giulia Quadrifoglio. As you can see here, the stock car is a 2017 model, whereas the Forza Edition version is made in 2016. I doubt there are any differences between the two, and I truly believe this was just a mistake by Playground Games. What do you guys think? Number 6, another funny moment. Alright, so um, I'm guessing you're going to do a stunt, and uh, let's hope it goes well. I'm assuming that it's not because this is classed as a funny moment. And I don't know what you tried to do there, but... Oh, no. <laughs> Man, I don't even know if that's a funny moment or a skillful moment, let alone an unfortunate moment. But... <laughs> I bet you that you won't be able to replicate that again. Anyways, a huge shout out to GamingGNAT424347 from Xbox for sharing this with all of us. Thank you. And lastly, number 7, the Porsche Singer. Alright, so just yesterday, Forza released this tweet announcing that they will be doing a special live stream for the launch of the new Xbox console. However, what was interesting about the tweet is that they also released a close-up shot of a car's taillight. Now, usually when Forza makes a tweet similar to this, it's often a clue for an upcoming car that is going to be released soon, flanked by a series of clues known as Torben Tuesdays a week prior. But this time, we got no Torben Tuesday, but just an image of what appears to be a new car that's currently not in Horizon 4, revealed at a very unusual time. So, looking at the rear taillights themselves, there has been a few guesses that the community have come up with. One was the Ferrari F8 Tributo, but the most convincing guess, and I was thinking the same too, was the Porsche Singer DLS. As we can see in some of these images here, those taillights are quite similar to the teaser photo that Forza tweeted. Not only that, a couple of weeks back, I made this video saying that sometime soon, based on the leaked list, we will be getting a Porsche Singer. And well, I'm glad I'm not wrong. Not sure how this car will be released though. Will it be a part of the next update? Is it going to be a special next generation Xbox exclusive? Because it is a very early time to reveal the next update. I'm not exactly sure. I guess we'll just have to tune in and watch the live stream. So there we have it guys, seven hidden secrets, easter eggs, glitches and funny moments that you the subscribers have sent in for Forza Horizon 4. If you guys did enjoy this video, please make sure to smash the thumbs up button, that would really help me out. And remember, if you guys have any clips that you want to send to me, all of the links will be down in the description below. Any social media will do and I look forward to all of your submissions. Anyways, if you guys would like to see more Forza Horizon 4 content right here on this channel, make sure to click the subscribe button with notifications turned on that way you won't ever miss out on another video that goes live and i hope to see you guys in the next video peace